Let's rack and stack some shit. Okay, so I've got a whole bunch of data center equipment that I want to rack and stack for a lab at home as well as maybe some node hosting, uh, things like that. And in order to do that, um, I've got to clean up a few things first. So I just want to say, don't judge me. Or do, I don't really care. First things first is we got to open this big um, sand that I ordered. So I've got a big stack of uh, servers here there's a sand on the bottom a whole bunch of network switches on top got this sand over here this guy where's that down here is uh 220 ups that we're gonna put not all of it but some of it into this uh 12u rack so let's get to it Oh man, look at all the storage bays in this bad boy. So this is a little 12U rack that I got from Marketplace for like 50 bucks. Eventually. That wasn't too bad. Here's where we're at so far. I've got it assembled. I've got uh, rails in place and a UPS sitting on a shelf down here. So that takes up four U's. 2,000 years later. Over the uh, last couple days, I finally got this cluster racked and stacked. I'm gonna need to run a uh, another 30 amp circuit out here in order to power them on while I've got my miners running in the next room. There's a uh, APC 220 volt UPS. It's got two Power Edge R730s here. Uh, not much storage on board but plenty of storage for a uh, VMware hypervisor. And then up here, we've got a SAN from a company that's no longer in business, that's uh, Reduxio. This is a uh, hybrid flash SAN where we've got 800 gig SSDs and then two terabyte 7200 drives uh, sat up. We'll talk more about Reduxio at another time because there's a lot to talk about and a lot to learn. Got a uh, network switch up here. This is definitely not gonna be the final uh, switch that's gonna be used for uh, for the setup. It's an SG350, uh, 52, so it's 52 port gigabit, uh, layer three Cisco switch. So hopefully within the next uh, month or so, I'll get a, a dedicated circuit run out here, get these set up with a uh, HA cluster, so high availability, 56 cores on CPU. Either way, uh, what kind of cool projects I can do with my uh, home lab here. I'm gonna spin up a couple of crypto nodes, uh, a Zen node, probably a pre-search node, flux node, might even run a full lightning node do some videos on networking, setting up public IP addresses, setting up VPNs. So each of these servers came out of uh, our data center. Uh, each of them has a graphics accelerator card. And I've got about 120 terabytes over here that I did have dedicated to Chia. Also got, you know, that whole Reduxio SAN, but it's pretty power hungry. So we'll have to see if we can utilize it for a Project Thunder type of service. Anyway, uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about my little home lab here. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And of course, thanks for watching.